Hi there, I'm Ludwig and this is Data Platform Microlearning. In today's episode, I'm going to answer the question that I do get a lot, especially when I'm teaching using Zoom or Teams or any other performing any other remote work. Because whenever you're screen sharing your virtual machine, for example, you know that if you write any kind of code, so let's say that I just want to say select, uh, I don't know, user name, boom. So I want to know how I'm called in this particular system, right? I'm going to execute this code and you can see that regardless of how large your query pane will be, the result set, the result pane will always stay the same, right? So it will be always very small. So if you wanted to give your users better experience well first of all when you're working on windows i'm working on a mac right now but if you're working on windows zoom it is a perfect tool to have all of the zooming tool zooming tools uh, at hand it's a perfect tool coming from sys internals uh, and it's available on microsoft websites as well but on a mac you're stuck with just a zoom but what you can do you can expand the font size you can increase the font size of the result grid and in order to do that you need to go to tools you need to go to customize you oh sorry you need to go to options here we go boom and then not in general but in fonts in colors here we go you can switch the settings from the text editor to in here to grid results and you can change your font directly from here to choose whatever it works best for you one for word of warning in order to have those changes be applied in your system you will have to uh, you will have to restart your uh, SSMS, so SQL Server Management Studio. If you want more tips like that, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next episode.